WA Tech Talks. My name is Laura and I'm going to be showing you how you can set up a Google document form, uh, Excel document to set up your parent interviews. So I'm just going to type into Google, Google Drive and that will take me into this top one. I can click into it. Now as you can see here, I'm signed in with my school Google Gmail address. You if you don't already know that, just come and talk to Tony, Neil or Laura and we'll be able to tell you what your username and password is and get you guys set up on that. So I am going to create a Google spreadsheet for the uh, parents to sign up on. So I click on create and go to spreadsheet. And from here it's, it's pretty easy in the top one we can just put times put names here and from here you just fill in the time so 8.45 to 9 o'clock for the 15 minute slots 9 o'clock to 9 9.15 to 9.30 and so on all the way down remember to leave yourself some time take the times out that you don't want the parents to come in so if you want your 15 minutes half an hour for lunch remember to leave those times out the parents will then go in and they can fill in when they they can then write in their name so when they want to come and see you in this way they can go on and if somebody's already in their slot they immediately know they have to pick another slot it might be key just to put a please make sure you don't delete anyone else's name because we do not want that to happen so probably make sure you put that at the bottom of your form so that um, you can make sure that the parents aren't deleting other people's names I'm sure they won't but just in case and now once you've finished it that's that's it's easier to, as it is to set it up if you want to make sure make it so it looks like a table you can highlight it click on the borders click like this and then you've got it in table format once it's all completed you can click on share over here. We'll call it parent interview sign up and click save. So it needs a name. Okay, at the moment this is private, so we're going to change that. And we're going to say anyone with a link. And we're going to so we'll click on this one here. And then we're going to click can edit because you want the parents to be able to go in and then they can um edit it and put their names in then you click save and all you need to do now is copy this link so copy it and then you can either paste it into a email so parents say if you had a parents list you can just paste it in there or you can paste it as a link onto your Weebly and then you click done hope that helps any questions remember you can always come and ask us thank you